Hello, my name is Stephanie Contreras and I'm going to be sharing with you the difference between alkaline water and Kangen water. The real difference in explanation terms is that Kangen water is actually coming out of an electrolysis system and what it is is that these waters here which are the alkaline waters have now been added minerals which are in the back of this bottle, you can actually look and read the ingredients. It, in this water in particular, the Essentia, because there's several alkaline waters on the market now, you can see that they're basically purified water by a reverse osmosis, that's what it says here, and it's sodium bicarbonate, depotassium phosphate, magnesium sulfate, and calcium chloride, and it has a little um, asterisk here that says electrolytes for taste. Well, I'm actually going to show you how that's how they actually make this water alkaline. But before I do that, I want you to understand why we've actually made the change to King and Water, and the actual benefit of drinking King and Water is actually a property called the antioxidant. The antioxidant is actually measured by reading the ORP monitor at a negative level, which means that it actually has a negative charge which comes and acts as an electron in the body. So there's definitely a more scientific explanation, but right now I'm going to show it to you visually so that you can understand it. What I have here is some tap water. I brought in Fiji because a lot of people have already made the switch to Fiji, um, maybe because they think it's a better water as well. And I just want you to take into consideration that this has been bottled for more than several months, maybe even over a year. Okay, why? Because it's actually coming from Fiji, so it had to be longer in production for it to even get into your hands. We also have Aquafina, Dasani. These are 60% of all bottled water beverages in the United States. And you can imagine with Pepsi Cola and Coca Cola being competitors and how much marketing dollars are going into these products that it's just really taking up the market. Now this has now come into the market to start taking some up and people think that that's going to be the best option or that it's even better than King and Water or the same. And I'm going to show you why it's not and it's mainly because it does not have that antioxidant property. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. I'm actually showing you here that regular tap water has an ORP of about 200. Okay, and that's actually not horrible, but because it's positive, that means that it's oxidizing your body, which is causing more sickness and aging in the body. Okay, so about 234. We have here Fiji. Fiji's actually rising 275. It means that it has more oxidation than tap water. That's right, our bottled waters have more oxidation, which means that they're actually causing sickness and aging. Check this out. Aquafina, it's going above the 270, 280, and it's even going above 300. And that's insane because it's water. And so this is really the why we want to make that change. This is oxidizing our body. It's killing off your cells. It's creating sickness. It's creating aging or speeding up that aging. Check out Dasani. Wow in the 370s. Now this Essentia bottle, let's check it out. This is going down a bit, somewhere in the 200s. And that means that it's lower in oxidation, but because it is positive and we're now down to the 190s, it is still oxidizing the body. What we wanna see is antioxidants in our beverages as King and Water shows here, negative 700. Okay, that's extremely high in antioxidants, which means that is pretty much getting rid of the damage that something like the Essentia will do in the body. We can see Essentia has now gone up to positive 170 and rising. And as soon as I jump into the King and Water, we have negative 690 which is an abundance of antioxidants coming into the body. This is really the main difference, and it's somewhat difficult to understand unless you understand you know, the basics of electrons and the protons, and I will share a video about that 
So look out for that. The scientific um, explanation of the difference between alkaline and the king in water. So the next thing we're gonna look at so that you can understand this is that pH. Because when people say alkaline water, they're actually talking about the pH. So I have pH drops here, and I'm just gonna drop a few in the tap water. You can see that this is somewhat neutral, and you can take a look at the tap, uh, I'm sorry, the pH right under there. You can Google it, it's, it's a universal chart, okay? We can see Fiji, it's pretty much like tap water, okay? These are very bad waters. These are at an acidic pH, which means that they're actually, you know, really harming the body and putting your body in a state where sickness can thrive. Now, this is alkaline water, and you can actually see that it is alkaline as alkaline as our king and water. So you may be asking yourself, well then why do I want to drink king and water? Well again, it really comes down to the antioxidant factor, but I'm also going to show you how they make this water. Because as I mentioned that it has ingredients, what they've pretty much done is taken a purified reverse osmosis water and they have added some minerals, which is either some form of calcium, magnesium, potassium, or sodium into the acidic water in order to make an alkaline water. So I tell people, you don't even have to overpay for this. I paid about $2.19 for one bottle, okay? And a few bucks for also the baking soda, but really this is cheaper. You can drop it in there, probably get 24 of these for what you can get, maybe one of these, or at least 10 to 15 of them, okay? And if you just add a little bit of baking soda, you can get alkaline water. Now let me show you. Just because it is alkaline, it does not mean it is an antioxidant. It is now at 270s, which means it's still oxidizing the body. It goes down because you've now added minerals to it. However, it is still oxidizing the body, which means it is still causing sickness and aging. What I wanna share with you next is what's actually gonna happen when you drink king and water. You can see that you're actually going to cleanse the body and be able to have a cleaner, more alkaline state, but you will also start to notice that you will also receive antioxidants into the body. And the more king and water I add, the higher the antioxidant level will be. But you can see that this turned to negative 100 and negative 115 right around there. Okay, so as you're drinking the Kangen water, not only are you going to change the state inside your body so that sickness and aging do not thrive, but you're also going to be adding the antioxidants into the body. Okay, this is very critical because without antioxidants, you basically have oxidation. And that is what we want to avoid because oxidation is what's causing sickness and aging. Anything from cancer, diabetes, arthritis, high blood pressure, high cholesterol, asthma, you have skin conditions, which are, you know, your eczema, psoriasis, and many other diseases that are degenerative diseases. And what that means is that as you're degenerating the body, it's because of oxidation. So I hope that helps you understand why get rid of this because there's also um, side effects to drinking this water. Even though people think, oh, well, I like it better and it tastes better. The reality is if you were eating baking soda on a daily basis, just imagine what that'll do to your body over a year, two years, or three years. This would probably end up inside your body. And what that looks like over time is your blood getting thicker, so causing either heart problems or a heart attack, and gallstones and kidney stones. So to, in order to avoid that, change to Kangen water. It is a medical grade water. It has been scientifically now studied so that we can understand that it's actually bringing in more oxygen to the body. It's like meditating at a cellular level with water. Now water is essential. Thank you for taking a look at this clip so that you can understand the difference between alkaline and king and water. Have yourself a great day and check out some more videos. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.